Hi guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video, we're going to talk about the latest Windows 11 Insider preview build for the beta channel, which is the build 22062.440. In this video, we're going to talk about what is new and what has changed, what is improved and also what is fixed in the beta channel of the Windows Insider program. For those of you who didn't see any beta channel builds before, well, you need to know that the beta channel is separated into two different builds, the 22,622 and the 22,621. Basically, the ones for from the 22,621 will have the new features turned off by default, but you can always install the build that has all the features installed by default, which is 22,622, by going into Windows Updates and manually installing it. Those things being said, if you enjoy videos like these, don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. Let's begin with the video. For those of you wondering why I have this huge scaling on this computer, well, I wanted to show you the new taskbar over overflow feature that was also implemented in the beta channel of the Windows Insider program. So now when the taskbar is full, you should see this new button with three points, taskbar overflow menu. If you click on it, you should have all the icons that were overflowed in the taskbar. It actually looks pretty good. As you can see, we have a nice little acrylic effect, a nice little animation. It looks really good and it works as it should, in my opinion, really simple and efficient. So this new taskbar overflow feature is beginning to roll out so it won't be available to all Windows Insiders in the beta channel but of course if I find a way to manually enable it on the beta channel I will show you in a different video. We also have some improvements for both builds 22,621 and 22,622. We have the dynamic widgets which is also a feature that is slowly rolling out. I don't think I have it enabled I only have the weather icon but the dynamic widgets on the taskbar is a feature that will bring dynamic content on the taskbar related to finance, breaking news alerts and stuff like that. Maybe it is interesting, but uh, hopefully it won't be really intrusive in the operating system. We also have the new open with menu in this build from the beta channel, which looks really good. You saw it before, but now it is fully implemented in the operating system and it looks really, really nice. And it brings up the level of the open with menu to match the Windows 11 experience. Also another important news regarding the settings app. If you go to apps and installed apps here, you will now be able to see and uninstall install apps which have interdependencies such as Steam and gaming apps running on Steam, repair and modify Windows 32 apps. I think that is really cool. Of course, that was all only possible from the old control panel before this. Let's talk about some fixes in this build. First of all, Microsoft fixed an issue leading to some insiders experiencing Explorer.exe crashes when docking and undocking monitors in build 22622.436. Related to the file explorer, Microsoft did some work to fix a memory leak when using tabs with File Explorer. They fixed an issue where Narrator wasn't reading out the titles of tabs as focus moved through them. Fixed an issue where the preview thumbnail for File Explorer and the taskbar all plus tab and task view might show the title of an adjacent tab and not the currently selected one. And also the new tab button shouldn't overlap with the minimize button in the title bar when using text scaling with lots of tabs open anymore. So basically this is it for this new build for the better channel. You can check out all the list of fixes and improvements and also the known issues in the article below in the description. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the tech base channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBased. Until next time, I wish you all a nice day.